seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Hello, we are back with another Cyber Fun Day. I know it's been three long weeks, but hey, we made it work. We got one here tonight. Woo-hoo! It's a smaller show, but we got some cool stuff for you tonight. A couple things we haven't had before, such as these coming up right away. Yep. Um, so a lot of the things you'll see tonight is pretty common, but we have some new in-box stuff, I think, still. Um, some certified, some really nice certified sets. And then some open sets. Whoa, that cop was flying. Whew. <laughs> it was like lightning. Woo! Yeah, if you guys aren't aware, we have a major street in front of our store, so cars go. I yeah, feel, plus the feeling like 55. I just saw the flashing blue yeah, light. Yeah, usually like, don't. Well, okay. <laughs> so I hope you guys are ready. For those of you who have been tuning in here and there, we appreciate you guys. Happy holidays. So hopefully, you know, fingers and toes crossed, we can get one more in next week before yep. the holiday season and the end of the year. Yes, if, if we are able to do another one, which we are, we are going, we're gunning for it. Um, next Cyber Fun Day will the next and final summit Cyber Fun Day of 2022 will be next weekend. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. After next weekend, we will not be having any more of the rest of 22. Yeah, but who, yeah, and if you do it, you got to figure out who's hosting. And we've got uh, New Year's coming up around the corner after Christmas, and we have a five year anniversary, five year story anniversary well, coming, up after that, so coming up. So we may not actually have a Cyber Fun Day for like three weeks. Another three weeks. <laughs> Another three so. weeks. I know, I know. It's but we're like, going to have a lot of really cool, awesome things here going on. So that's important for all of you locals that watch us. Because yes. we're going to have a lot of events, a lot of giveaways, and different things going on between now and Christmas and after the New Year. So a lot of things going on. Uh, I do want to say we got a lot of people in here saying hi. we got Nicole uh, joining us here. She's excited for the show. we got Nick Gundy in here. What's up? Uh, Lisa Sturgeon saying, finally, yay, yes, we're back. Uh, Colin Lewis and the Lewis family are watching. Awesome. we got the Gillespies saying happy Friday. Bricks and Liam is joining us, and of course we got Shannon Martin and the Martin family joining us as well, and saying hello and happy hello. birthday to Lisa. It's Lisa's birthday. Should we sing happy birthday? Yeah, why not? For, for Lisa, why not? Yeah. All right, on a one, on a two, on a one, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to, to you. you. <laughs> Happy right. birthday. We so we're going to get right into it. So for those of you joining in, welcome back. We appreciate you guys. This is how it works. There are only 31 lots here tonight, three of them being our mystery boxes. Funny enough, before our mystery boxes, there's going to be something even more ironic next to those. So uh, <laughs> Wait, us being ironic? When does that happen? Oh, well. So you guys have to put in the comments below, I claim lot number one, two, 31, whatever it is for the exact price that we show up on screen. The first person we see on the RN gets it and gets to call and pay for it tomorrow or come and pick it up, up until the following Sunday, which is our minifig trade night. Yes, also I minifig spot day from three to five, uh, and it is December 18th, mm-hmm. a week before yep, the so big Ryan day. Yeah, so Ryan and Owen, I believe, will be here for that. Yes. And uh, yeah, you guys got a lot of stuff going on next weekend. Oh, I know. We're we're jamming. I have a lot of stuff going we're on. We're packing week, stuff in, so. and that's not even including the eighty-five emails I have to send out. What you what's have a lot of stuff going on. What's new for David? What's new for David? What's new for David? What do you mean? What's he's new been, for David? He's been packing and using lots of boxes. Oh yeah, David. What have you been doing? I'm moving. <laughs> You're what? I'm moving into an apartment. Wow! Huzzah! I'm going to be very busy. Even more next week. Dave is finally moving out of this house, out of his no, parents' house. Been out before. Been out before. He's moving out again. <laughs> <laughs> I was at Naperville for six months, seven months. That's not long enough. No, it was not. <laughs> no, it was not. Uh, yes, so David is getting out of here, or not My out of here, but out of his home. when I got back was not that great either. <laughs> I had no doors or nothing. It just ripped it all off. It was, no, I was like, Literally, the living room when he walked in the house. It was like, hello, David, you're sleeping. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's like, yeah, I'm sleeping. It's 3 a.m. Why are you walking in at 3 a.m.? Dun, dun, dun. Don't you work at a warehouse? I do, and I'm going to be up in 30 minutes, so thanks. <laughs> <laughs> so anyway, yes, we got Dave's got stuff going on. 
uh, we're doing things and setting up stuff for for, for this for so, Brick World right. in June. And so we got all if, sorts of things going on. If we do a cyber fun day next week, if anybody wants to host, I will not be here. So by all means, I think we may have Owen and one our or two volunteers. Guy. By all means, we may have Owen and our new guy host. Ooh. Maybe we'll do a twofer. Ooh. Ooh. Um, you oh, know, it's a little gonna, bit of verse in it, so it'll it'll work. Yeah, we'll see how their dynamic plays out too. We'll you see, know, we'll see. Um, but yeah, so we, we are getting ready for, of course, our five year anniversary coming up in January, which is awesome. January we're be five 1st, years. But you guys are going to celebrate like on the seventh and eighth yeah. weekend, which is also our wedding anniversary, Sarah's wedding anniversary. So am I working two weekends of this? <laughs> no, well, we usually work here. On, I mean, we we had a grand opening pretty much on our anniversary too. So yeah, it's not a big deal. shouldn't I be here for the opening in history? What's that? Coldest opening in history. Coldest opening in Bricks history. That's correct. And they get a 17 degrees Fahrenheit. Yes. Um, because I'm working the weekend before, so. and then um, we also have our building competition going on with uh, Metal Monkey Brewing in February. We yeah, got Brick World coming up, and we got February or uh, Brick World coming up in June. I mean, there's so many other events that are coming up all the time. Um, and of course, we're working with some special projects. We've got our new um holiday droidica that's going to be available in should be hopefully ne early next week. We're still waiting for the last bed of parts very to come festive, in. Very festive, very um, It's all red, white, and green. It's the Star Wars droidica. Um, you can order multiples, um, but we do ask that you hopefully don't order more than like let's say two per person um, because we do have 30 of them and we want to be able to yeah, just share them with sure everybody and not have the, like as, everybody gone. As many people as we can because it was just something fun that Ryan whipped up. Um, funny enough, I have an all white one here in the case for the new scavenger. Yes. Hunt. Which, Should I show them? Should I show them before uh, we get yeah, started? Yeah, yeah why not? Why not? Okay. It's beautiful. It's awesome. It's festive. So this is our new display. Look at all the white. So we've got all sorts of scenes over here. We've got our, actually a little Chris Kringle market, thanks to Tim, our new employee. Oh, I found it. We've got um, the Sanctum Sanctorum over here, of course. We've got all of our buildings in here. Um, doing some crazy things. We've got a nice little holiday train going through town. I can't really talk about too much because this is for our scavenger hunt, of course. Um, and the scavenger hunt this month is for prizes. And we are actually, for this month, going to be giving away a new coupon calendar, or gift certificate calendar, um, that we're getting in January. Um, that's going to be worth over $200. We're going to be giving away three of those. Um, to three lucky winners if you come in and complete this month's scavenger hunt. Will be and they will be tested, yes. All right, Dave, we got to get back over here. We're going to go up and over. Yeah, okay. I don't want to spoil anything, even though we don't have too many things tonight. All right, so if you guys are ready, we're going to get right into it. There's a lot of stuff, not really, but some awesome stuff. <laughs> There's some cool stuff tonight. There's some cool, cool stuff. stuff. Um, Christopher, you good? He's got his thumbs up already. You Sarah ready? looks good? like she's You're good. Coffee? You're not getting up, right? But, cool. but Sarah's mind is always somewhere else, so who knows? All right. <laughs> Love you, doll. <laughs> she just gave me the look. I'm not going home with her. <laughs> <laughs> Funny enough, I'm not going home with her either. I just end up at home. My bet then is he's going to die, not me. <laughs> I can get away with my life. What do you mean? I'm just stating. I'm not going to be in the line of fire. That's all. <laughs> Chris, you'll be in the line of fire for sure. We'll just, put, we'll just put the bigger one in because apparently Chris is now officially taller than I am. It's it's very close. It's it's very close that Chris, our twelve year old, is also taller than us. Well, I know for sure he's taller than both of you, so we're we already got that covered. That's great. I'm just saying. Just that just means I can get to the ground quicker and pull him to the ground. <laughs> 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 right. Oh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sarah. If I only have like, if I only had two cameras, I could just sit here and like have this and just be like record both sides. That'd be hilarious. Well, you know, know maybe you maybe be doing that to your kid. Maybe though. we really should just like hook that camera up too, so people can eventually see you guys too behind the scenes. Uh, <laughs> all right, guys. We could. We, we could. Well, and right. and funny enough, we actually uh, our streaming platform now has a two camera option. That's now included as well. So we can show your face and my face? Um, I would have to have another thing, though. Because, like, the, oh, one, yeah. the one phone can't do both. Yeah, because with all these smartphones, you can't share the camera. Yeah, but if I had a second, if I grabbed the other one and held it here, <laughs> that's a lot of work. <laughs> all right, we're going to get right into it before this gets into too much stuff. All right, so here we go. Lot number one is a very old set. This is a yellow three-in-one creator set. The beach house. This is the main build. How are we starting off a winter kind of show with a beach house? Whose thought was that? Warm thoughts. That's <laughs> why. I don't know. I just had Tim put it there. Jeez. 
All right, yes, this uh, beach house is a creator's free in one day. Why don't we show off what else this has? Yep, yeah, so this is the main build here. You also have this one with a longer backyard, or um, this might be like a little restaurant kind of ordeal because that looks like a kitchen. And then, and then dun, 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 dun. which, funny enough, we have had these two in more often as builds than this one. Than the third one, one? yep. Yeah. But this is a really cute uh, half sheet house. So it is, I think, uh, a half base plate or a yeah, five by it's ten. It's not a bad uh, base plate. It does come with a cute little grill, a nice little tree. Um, there are no mini figures that come with this build, which is kind of interesting. Nope, there's and usually it's an one or empty two, house, so you can house. you can decorate it. But there's a fireplace already installed, so that's kind of nice. Um, but it's a really cute display, and, and tonight it is on sale for forty five dollars. Not too bad. Do 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 do, do. Oh. and it does come with. All the extra points. Yep. Next up here is our heavy cargo transport. Comes with two minifigs, a heavy hauler, and this really nice helicopter. Box and instructions, so it is complete. And tonight you can go home with this here for twenty-five dollars. It's twenty-five dollars. Getting the heavy hauler with the That's helicopter. Nice. We've had and it here twice. Before. The chain here, as you guys see, is actually to hook up this little octane like oil yes, drum here. Yeah. You just kind of hook it up. He's gonna hook it, hook it, hook oh, it. I'm trying to turn it. There you go. Bloop, bloop. How many people does it take to hook on a little thing? Oh my, the hook was twisted. I didn't realize. So. So yes, it's got a nice little uh, cute airlift uh, helicopter over here. Not of course, it's got a nice little uh, chain release there. Some actual tool areas and all sorts of things for this awesome black and red heavy cargo transport. It's a nice design for the truck. Good scale yep. too. All right. Next up here for the first time ever on the stream and in the store, we have two lunch box or little like tote bags here. Tonight, you could get either the yellow one or the orange one for $20 each. These are brand new without their like official tag. There's yep. three storage area in the front, box. Velcro pocket on the inside, lined buckle. interior with a removable buckle. So you can actually take this off yep. and clip it on the bag. And then look, the, zipper, well. the zippers are one by two plates look at that would have been cool if this was like an actual plate yeah and then you could just, yeah, stick, just stick things onto it, it. That would have been um, nice. but these are officially like uh, li officially licensed lego products uh yep. that actually See? our stores right usually there. carry but we haven't carried this in in a little while um or we haven't carried it in our store yet but we are looking into having this as one of our new items uh for next year as well um but tonight uh we have these guys on sale for 20 percent off uh, you guys can pick this up Good for $20 teaser. for either one, the orange or the yellow. Just let us know which one you want. Of course, when you claim lot number three. All right, next up here, one of our biggest certified sets of the night. This is a sealed, complete treehouse set. And, and by sealed, it means the box is open, but all the bags are sealed. Yes. yes I but do. we have the Lego Ideas Treehouse. Do, 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 do. Yep, and this is definitely one you want to winterize too because you could change it to fall and then you could put some of the white leaves on it and wake it into winter. Yes, as you can see, there's a little, little damage yeah, and stuff little, to the box. Cut but here. this is a current existing set, and tonight uh, it is on sale. Um, so you can save $50 or 20% off of the original retail for this set if you pick it up tonight. So yes. it is 100% still sealed in the bags. The box is inside. All the bags are inside the box and everything else. Um, we've been double, uh, Chris and I actually double checked this up together. It looks amazing. It's the second one we've had, I think, in two weeks. Um, the other one sold right away. This one will too, I'm sure. If you guys love the treehouse, this is the way to get it. Lot number four, $200. All right, moving on, Dave. What do we got on number five here? This All is right. a new arrival. Lot number five, this is a Technic Land Rover. This thing is one of the top Technic sets that Lego has ever made. And it also comes with a bonus. Brand new light kit. Look at this. You get all this in here, the instructions, every one of the little lights to feed right into the build, which gives, uh, I think it's like an app or something you download, and it goes through the whole thing. Uh, I'm not 100% sure. Yes, but this one does have the instructions inside the box. Um, the Land Rover here actually has, um, what's really, really cool about this one, has probably the best suspension of any Lego display model we've ever had. Um, it has dual coilover suspension, so if you actually look under here, there's actually two shocks in there instead of just one in both fronts. And then, of course, singles in the rear. Um, it does have a inline six engine, of course, that uh, does move with the gears. There's a gear shifter, neutral and reverse. It also has a pull-out um, winch that is activated with this little knob right here. 
Um, it has roof storage on top. This one actually comes out. These piece panels come right off because these are actually to use for when you get stuck in the mud. You can put them underneath your tires to get back out. Um, doors open up on both sides as well. And then your uh, roof ladder comes down, folds down right, for you. Right, and then you. the rack comes off, too. The rack can come off. And then the rear tire actually acts as the door handle. So if you turn it the other way and then the door opens up, there's a whole little spring or uh, rubber band mechanism in here. Um, and then, of course, you can see all the transmission and stuff on the inside as well. So really, really cool set. Uh, we actually have fun drop testing this every time people get scared because we'll drop it from like four feet up and it just goes, it just bounces like crazy. It's awesome. Um, so this is one of the really cool sets and 2,500 pieces, a little over 2,500 pieces for only $140. And that includes the light kit, the bonus light kit. So awesome, awesome set. I think normally it was like 200 bucks, I think. So yeah, it is a really nice set. Uh, it's not one we have here too often, but, but I mean, I think like, we've had it like three times. I was, I, I was luckily able to build it for a customer once. Um, who was given it as a gift from a Land Rover dealer, funny enough. Yeah, no, it's a really nice one. I've seen some people, like, mod it, and you can motorize it, which is really nice. Mm -hmm. I think you were able to... You can, like, you, if you actually do the right battery. things, you can actually RC it. Yeah. There's actually people, on uh, YouTubers, that have actually completely RC'd the car. Which yeah, is really I thought cool. there was a way where you, like, took some of the back out for the seats, and then you could put the battery pack and everything. Well, yeah, well, in the front, you just hook up the one motor for the steering, which is easy. It's just yeah, like the new servo steering, and then the other one for the engine. Yep. All right, what do we have over here? Lot number six. Next up here is Elsa's Magical Ice Palace. This is the second version of her palace with some snow geese and snow Olaf. Geese. And I think this was Snowball. I I think. Yeah. yeah? I, don't, I don't. I think that's right. I think that sounds right. I think I only remember because Owen was like, oh, no, it's Snowball. Well, Owen is watching, so we'll see if he has a comment on that. Uh, but it also does have, of course, the Ice Palace here, which is the newer version, as Dave said. Um, has, I believe, the doors open up and separate up here. Um, yeah, you have, you to, have to, like, to hit the mechanism. I can't do it with one hand. There you go. So it pulls forward, of course, because you can put Elsa on the inside, of course, in your Let It Go song yeah. or whatever else. It opens up. The top opens up. Uh, unfortunately, there's no chandelier to help impale people on the inside. Oh, there is a chandelier to impale people. I'm spring-loaded. <laughs> I didn't see that back there. I yeah, it's a little missile. Yep. <laughs> it's a little, yep. So you can impale people. Um, that's always fun. Yeah, I think this is supposed to go, like, over... A little bit more to drop. I'm not 100. percent I don't think so. Um, so we have Elsa's magical ice palace here, complete for 45 dollars. That's pretty nice, though. Little slide kitchen. All right, moving on to our little lot number seven. Next up here, this is from the Lego Batman movie, Scarecrow's special delivery with this like mutant pizza. Um, if you twist this, this will pop open, and then there's like a mutant pizza in here. Right there. Mutant pizza. Yep, so we got those in here. This is complete, and tonight you can go home with this set here for $16. $16. Yeah, it's a nice set. I like this little, like, scooter pizza truck. Yeah, um, I can't... Uh, John's gonna kill me. I can't remember the name of those. They have a name. Uh, we do have our first claim of the night from Miriam Valencia claiming lot number seven in the Scarecrow Delivery. Nice, and it, and it turns, too, so you yes, can get it's a full, pivot, like... Which is really nice because you can actually set it down in different, you know, cute little lingles and pull nice little UVs and stuff with it. Awesome. Cool. Well, congratulations to Miriam for the first claim of the night. All right, next up here for the first time on the stream, we have this... Big, heavy hauler. Ryan, you want to tell them about it? Yeah, so this is the uh, heavy-duty tow truck. has lots of features. Of course, um, Chris had already displayed the front engine over here as well. It's got another inline-six engine, very, very similar to the uh, Land Rover engine. Um, this one has rooftop steering, so as you uh, control from the top, the uh, wheels move as well. That's just one of the many, many features on the set. This set is actually uh, both mechanical and pneumatic. Um, so this one actually has a little pneumatic pump right here on the side. Uh, some levers here as well as two knobs on this side and two knobs on the other side. Um, this first knob here actually raises and lowers the entire back just a little. You can see it's just going up on a little angle there. The second knob here actually raises and lowers your sixth wheel in the back. So we can actually take that and lift it up. And then of course you have your knob over here. If you lift this down, give it a good pump, the lower um, release here will actually operate, and then of course you can pull that back up. Do, 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 do. And then you have some on the back side, 
as well. So if we lift up the knob in the back, it will actually extend out this boom, which it already has, because there's a little bit of air left in there. So it uh, extends both inwards and outwards, depending on which way you have it aimed. And if we flip the other one, of course, the main crane will actually lift. So you just gotta keep pumping it there. So that'll actually go pretty far up. There you go, that's locked. And then we have a couple knobs on the other side as well that will actually release the um, outriggers here, which are coming out on the sides. It's actually on both sides here. In the and then there's two in the back as well that you can see there are going down. And then if you go on, and then if you want to turn the other knob there, Dave, uh, you can actually aim the uh, crane as well. So if you need to do a heavy haul like pick up from the side, you can also do that. So a lot of playability in this set between all the different knobs, the levers, and of course, um, it's very much like a regular hauler, um, a regular heavy hauler when you're trying to pick up semi trucks or other things. Um, I have seen people actually pick up the Mac Anthem truck with this one, which is pretty impressive because you do get um, your two hooks up here, which are locked in, um, as well as your lift on the bottom. So a lot of really cool opportunity in this. It does come complete with box and instructions. Uh, for only a hundred dollars, so it's a two thousand piece set for only a hundred dollars. What's that? Press this and then you pull one of the levers. Yeah, just pull it down, and then you want to you want to keep pumping the pump. It'll go faster. Oh. And then go ahead and set that, and then put the other one down, and then it should retract this guy. Pump. There you go. That's cool. Done. Cool. So there's lot number eight with the heavy duty tow truck. That awesome set. No instructions? No That's instructions. not the instructions. No, this one has right. instructions. Oh, okay. okay. Well, I forgot which one he had because he was breaking the box. All right. So no instructions, but it has the box. <laughs> All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we go. We have lot number nine. This is an original 100% fixed up UCS tumbler. This here is complete. There was a lot of parts missing and some C clips that were very cracked. I managed to fix the last few, which were the wings here. And check out these figures here. Both these figures, especially the Heath Ledger Joker, are worth a lot for this set. And then when they re-release the set with slightly updated figures, it's still adjusted in the market because there's two different variants of both of them. Yes. So then... It has all kinds of features for it, such as the top. It's a little bit tricky. It's right here. Yeah, I know. It's going to come off right there. They stick on, kind of. So the top comes off, so you actually have the, the open T-top there, and you can see inside the cockpit and everything else. The controls. These rotate. The wheels rotate. Almost everything moves on this thing. <laughs> yeah, this thing is this thing is loaded. It, it is really nice. It's just, you know, one of it's those... It's big and clunky, of course. It's a big, giant set with big, beefy, and beefier wheels <laughs> yeah these are sweet yep but. and then uh this one does also come complete with all five instruction manuals as well yep. um and you can pick up this awesome ucs set here tonight for 160 dollars definitely has definitely has one of the best like joker designs here oh this is this is my favorite joker. i like the other one that they came out with with like his coat off so when he's like in the police station, just oh, clapping yep. like that one's a really good version too. But I can't beat that one. Yep. Can't beat that nope. one. Next up here, this one we have shown you before. This is our complete assembly square modular. It's an, uh, I think it's still current, right? Uh, it is still current. Yes, I think it's like two ninety nine, yeah, three hundred, something like that. It's still current. It's been up for a while, but yeah, it's, it's, it's a big a set. It's. Current. 4,002 pieces. Yeah, I mean, it, it's one of the best modulars they've come out with, and there's just all kinds of awesome things here. Um, a wide variety of people, including a little baby in the stroller, um, different restaurants, baby. apartment. I really like this, like, outdoors oven and kitchen they got here. On the back? Yeah, on the back half. Like, definitely one of my favorite spots here. Yep. Yeah, and of course, this is a modular, so it's got all the... Um, unique stairwells and everything else because they actually want you to pretend that your minifigures can go up and down all of the stairs to all the different levels. All the different floors come apart. And of course, you, you know, you've got a stand-up piano in here. If we take off another, actually this is a ballet class. You can see the little mirror in there. It's a mirrored uh, door panel right there. Um, you've got a music room. 
our music uh, store on the second floor, and I can't remember what's on the, the basement. Is it a florist or a coffee shop? I think it's a coffee shop. Uh, yeah, I think so. Um, so all of these come apart, which is really awesome. This is one of the widest um, modulars, if not the widest. It's actually a plate and a half. So you can actually see under here, there's actually a, a half plate right there. So it's a plate and a half. Um, so uh, it's a really, really cool set for 4,000 pieces. It's nuts, especially at 250 bucks. And it does come complete with the instructions and box as well. So this one is here, lot number 10 for $250. And it does include everything. Yes. Do, do, do. All right. Next up here, lot number 11, we have a complete White House. This is the second do, do, version do, of the White do, House do, for the do, 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 do. But it, it's definitely the better of the two. As you've seen, we've had the other one, the smaller version here, multiple times. We still have two here in the shop. But this one, look at this. Look at how they did the trees and the water fountain. Even the flag looks better. Right, this is a very well-designed White House. Considering the other one is just a one-by-one. One, right, it's top. just a one-by-one, one, <laughs> but like this actually has the flag and the trees and how they do these rounded one-by-ones, yep. one-by-two The shrubberies. Plates. Yeah. And the fountain is solid. Like, it's a one piece. And because they redid the mold for the, a lot of translucent parts, mm -hmm. this looks a little bit more like, um, what is it, where it's, like, glossy or... Yeah, it's a little more shiny. And I actually think this is one of the new ones that they used a little hint of uh, blue. So I, I have a really good feeling that that piece actually is also UV reactive as well. Because you can kind of, I can kind of see it. Yeah. So, but yes, the uh, architecture White House here, set number two one zero five four, can be yours with box and instructions for fifty five dollars. Yeah, I think we've had it on the stream once before, a long time. Ago. We haven't had it too many times. Yeah, we've had a lot of the other one, but not a lot of this one. Yeah, because it, yeah, it came out two years ago, and we just we don't see it often at all here. All right, next up here from the first ever Avengers movie, this is the Hulk Helicarrier Breakout. Yeah, funny enough, it was kind of included Hulk because Hulk, by the way, because uh, our Fortnite players out there, um, Hulk just entered Fortnite yesterday for the first time. Mm -hmm. du, 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 du. Mm -hmm. Yep, so Ant Meat Boot. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, so you get Loki, Thor, Hawkeye, and, uh, and Hulk in here. Um, and this awesome set, of course, it is a complete set. Jet. There's all kinds of features. Like if you move this, you can eject the cockpit off, mm -hmm. and jump and out. You tap this here, that'll come Hulk off. Breaks out. Well, Actually, that was Loki. Yeah. Loki Hulk, out. This is not big enough for that thing. Yeah, I just looked at it. Not even if Loki's. you take the arms but off. But of course, it. you know they're they're looking at uh, Loki's uh, spear and everything else too, because of course it's got the uh, power stone in it. What? Yep. And then look, if you want, you can play some uh, Galaga here. <laughs> yep. Thought so we wouldn't notice. The Hulk Solitary Breakout set can be yours for forty dollars on sale. All right, moving on to a new arrival here, lot number thirteen. We've got a new, well, almost new box, a, a certified sealed Ninjago City Garden set. This one is normally three fifty nine or something like that on Lego right now. Um, we have it here tonight on sale for only $300. This one is a 5,685 piece set. It is beautiful. It goes along with the Ninjago City and Ninjago City Gardens or Ninjago City Docks set. Yes. They all connect together. Um, I got to build the Ninjago City set. It was awesome. I haven't gotten to build this one. I'm really, I really love the whole really spire nice. and everything else. It's really cool. They pop a lot of really cool color in there. And look at all these figures that come with it. I mean, there is a ton of figures. And, of course, you get the Golden Limited Edition Master Wu as well. Um, and if we turn this around, Dave, can you turn, this, turn the box around carefully? I know it's a little heavy, so you may have to lift it and turn. There's all sorts of cute little scenes in here. And, of course, just like many of the other Ninjago City larger sets. Let's see if you can combine them together. Um, you have different aspects and different floors as well. So just like the modulars, you can... Um, go inside of each different restaurant, set up your different scenes and everything else. You have interchangeable plaques and arcade games, different posters. You've got an elevator, um, which corresponds to the elevator that's on the original Ninjago City. Um, so lots of really, really awesome playability here. 
and you get it tonight. And like I said, it's completely still sealed inside, all factory sealed. This is the box was opened before, as you can see with the tape marks on the top. Um, and you get it for a discount here, especially coming up for the holidays. You get Ninjago City Gardens for $300. Yeah, Lucky number 13. Said, all three of these together are definitely huge, and, huge and amazing. Yeah. Some of the best work Lego's ever done. And then you get the big Destiny's Bounty to go next to it. Dude, Boom, yep. Done. Yeah. It's, it, 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 they are really, really, really nice sets. But there's a lot of cute little nods to um, like Japanese culture well, I mean, and stuff you, that are there, in, too. In here, you get the little Lloyd. So that and the little yep. robot is like, pretty awesome. Yep. All right. Next up here, this is a sealed brick built General Grievous. General Grievous. Yep. So it's 100% brand new, sealed in box. Part of the buildable line that Lego had. One of the only really good looking sets that they made <laughs> for the buildables. Yeah, they did a really good job. There's like four that are really, really good. Uh, but yeah, this is one of the best ones they made. Uh, this is the buildable General Grievous. It is on sale tonight. Normally, I guess it normally is $80. We have it on sale tonight for $70. Um, so you get $10 off on this set tonight. Um, it does come complete with all four lightsabers. So you do get two green and two blue lightsabers as well. And look at this, the arms even detach from each other as well. So you can have it be a two-armed Grievous or four-armed Grievous um, as well, too. And you can put them next to your buildable Obi-Wan, and they can have their infamous battle with each other, or one of battles with each other. So lot number 14 can be yours for $70. Woo All right, Dave, tell us about lot 15. All right, lot number 15 from Ultra Agents. This here is our Spike Clops Infiltration set. Um, it's got three legs that you could rotate. Nice little spider-like face with three different blasters on it. You have the Spyclops and one of the Ultra Agents here. Tonight you can go home with this set for ten dollars. Ten dollars. <laughs> only ten dollars. Yeah, one, one of the cheapest huh? sets for no, tonight. No, we're not doing shekels. Shekels is over. <laughs> no shekels here. All right, nice and easy. Too many figs. Nice cute little set. All for ten bucks. Really, really cool set. All right, moving on to lot number 16. We got another architecture set. That's right, folks. We're bringing a little bit of Britain over to the United States here. We've got our London set here with the London Eye, Big Ben, the not London Bridge. Found that out. I can't remember what they call it, but it's not the London Bridge and, of course, Parliament. Uh, everybody thinks that this is the London Bridge. It's not. It's literally just called the Tower Bridge because of the towers. But the London Bridge, I found out, is actually next to it. It's a little tiny one. And they, I believe they actually ripped it apart after they built the new one. Uh, but there are old remnants of the London Bridge there. So, Cause, yes, because you know the London Bridge fell down. That's the whole song, you know. So the London Bridge really did fall. Uh, but the London set here, I believe, is complete with no, no, no instructions. Was that one? That was the one that did not come. So box with no instructions. Um, but you can pick this cute little setup here for only 25 bucks. Do -do -do -do. Yep, give me All one right. Here. I'm doing a little fix. <laughs> Dave's doing a little fixeroo. Should be able to find other parts for this too. So. All right. All right. Moving on to uh, lot number seventeen, the last lot of the first half. Yes, from the new Batman movie, we have here the prototype Batmobile and the Batman and Selina Kyle, aka Catwoman, cycle chase here. So tonight you can get both of these sets complete. The Batmobile does not have instructions. Um, I can grab the other blue energy parts now that I've put aside stuff from other bulk. <laughs> uh, otherwise, I mean, this car is solid. You can fit two people in here. Awesome detail. Fit some batterings on the back. And then you just tap the front and it shoots the missiles right there. Yep. Uh, we got Keanu Vasquez claiming lot number 16, the London Eye. The London right. set. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, Congratulations. Um, yes, we have uh, the Batman and Selena Kyle motorcycle chase, which is these guys over here, which comes with the um, bat signal light as well. Um, and then the Batman uh, penguin chase over here, of course, comes with Batman and the new penguin um, with the Batmobile, the Batman Batmobile. Yeah, the way they hid the missiles right in there is awesome. Yeah, it's right in the center there. Dave, you know, should, 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 see right there. Well, those are two little, like, rounded knobs. Yep. Dave has a tendency to shoot me with those. So that's why I kind of backed up a little bit. Don't do it. Don't do it. Dave, don't shoot Why? me. We haven't had don't, a Dad, don't shoot me. I don't, want to be, I don't want to be shot today. <laughs> Who says that? Except you're going to go go later, go home later and play Fortnite and be like, I still don't want to be shot today. <laughs> <laughs> you're not wrong. <laughs> I'm not wrong. All right. So before we get to our second half, we're going to do one 
recap here of the first 17 that we've shown you. Are you ready over there? This is probably going to be the last one of the year, boys By the way, a little sneak peek of new box stuff. Mm -hmm. Possibly, because I won't be here next week, and I don't, I don't know how well Tim. Oh, that's do. right. This might be I your last Owen, one. Right. I think Owen could do it pretty well, but I don't know about Tim. Just maybe, yet. maybe we'll have to change it up next week and do something oh, completely yeah, different. Yeah, maybe. Just well, we'll start a new tradition for 2023 and make, and make Dave change. <laughs> Is you know what? You know what? Just for that, rewind, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, Michael's that would not screw here. you up so bad. Recap, rewind. It would mess me up so. I can't do it. No. All right. So, without further ado, it's rewind recap time. Here we go. And of course, Sarah's over here wincing over here. She's across the store. <laughs> oh, right, guys. We're going to go ahead. Of course, we only have 17 lots for this first half. We're going to go ahead through these pretty quick. If you guys missed anything or just joining us, please let us know if you'd like to claim one of these sets. Just uh, type in the I claim lot number for the amount shown. Uh, if you can forget what it is, it's scrolling across the bottom of your screen as it comes around here. Uh, but for lot number one, we've got the infamous Creator Beach House here with uh, all three instruction booklets and extra parts for only $45. Lot number two from Lego City, we've got the heavy cargo transport with two minifigures, a transport, and a helicopter with boxes and instructions for $25. Next up, we have our uh, orange and yellow lunch boxes. We have these for $20 a piece. You can pick the yellow or orange. Just tell us which one you want after you claim lot number three for $20. Lot number four, moving on to Lego Ideas, we have a seed sealed certified set by Christopher and I. Um, this one is on sale tonight for $200, normally at, at least $249. Um, it is a current set. Uh, it has a little bit of a box damage, but otherwise 100% still factory sealed. Lot number five, moving on, is our Technic Land Rover Defender set with bonus light kit. Uh, this one is both on sale and you get the light kit for free. So you get the set for $140 tonight with box and instructions. Lot number six, we're going over to a little bit of a Disney side here with Elsa's Magical Ice Palace. Pick this one up with Elsa, Olaf, and the Snogies here tonight for $45. Uh, lot number seven is gone. Lot number eight is our heavy-duty tow truck here from LEGO Technic. has multiple different uh, playability options and, and realistic functions. You can get this entire set here for $100. You get all 2,000-plus pieces. All right, moving on around the corner to lot number nine, we have the UCS Batman Tumblr here, of course, with the Heath Ledger Joker and Batman, with all five books of instructions, with the um, awesome and crazily assembled uh, UCS Tumblr with lots of different movable parts and armored pieces as well. There's a lot of printed elements in there as well. Uh, so we have this one here for $160. Moving on to lot number 10, we have the uh, Expert Creator Assembly Square Modular here. This one comes with a slew of minifigures. I want to say there's 11. I think it's 11 minifigures plus a couple of the, like the models and dummies inside. Um, as well as the box instructions for this 4,000 plus piece set. And you can get everything here for $250. Moving around the corner here to lot number 11, we have the newer White House, of course. This is the bigger, longer White House. Uh, includes box and instructions for $55. Nice, cute set. And we have lot number 12 next to that one from the LEGO Marvel Super Heroes line. We have the Hulk's Hel Helicarrier Breakout set, including Thor, Loki, Hawkeye, and Hulk, uh, with a smaller Quinjet with ejectable roof. You get this set here tonight with instructions for 40 bucks. Lot number 13 uh, brings us over to the city of Ninjago for the Ninjago City Garden set. This one is a 5,700-piece uh, set, um, new or sealed in box still. This is a certified sealed set for $300 on sale tonight only. Moving on, we have our new in box uh, Buildable General Grievous. This is part of the Buildable series. They had about uh, 25 of these guys made. Um, and different, of course, different different characters. Uh, this one is definitely one of the best. Normally priced at eighty dollars, you can get it ten dollars off tonight on sale for seventy dollars. New in box. Next up was our um, agents of uh, Ultra Agents yes. sets over here. Uh, we have the Spyclops infiltration set with Spyclops and the Ultra Agent over here with his little mechanical um, three legged tripod machine, whatever you want to call it, uh, for this infiltration for ten bucks. And finally, lot number 17 comes from the new The Batman movie. 
with the Batman and Selena Kyle motorcycle pet pursuit and penguin chase. You get everything here with all four minifigures, additional head, and all three vehicles with motor are with instructions for thirty-five dollars. And that is the end of our first half. We're going to move on to our second half here, but of course we got to show off everything in between. We still have a slew of minifig stands, custom minifigure stands. If you guys are looking for um, some holiday gifts for your loved ones here, we've got all sorts of wall mounts, gears, um, some little sixteen. Um, Fig stands here as well, which are perfect for the series figs. And we even have our 30 fig three tier stands back in stock as well. So you can fit 30 figures on those. We have all of these in red, yellow, and blue, and some in multicolor as well. We've got all of our new in box sets, including our new arrival avatar sets. We have all four of those as well. And getting ready, of course, for the new movie coming out next week. So if you haven't um, seen it or whatever, or need some time, go back and watch uh, the original avatar. Yes, it's like two and a half hours long. Um, but it's amazing, it's awesome, and I can't wait for um, number two to finally come out. And then, of course, um, we have a new section here. As you guys can see here, this is a retiring soon section here. Um, this last four-foot section here is all sets that are going to be retiring in two weeks. Um, so they will be off the shelf, and they are going to be at least uh, probably 20 or 30% more expensive after the new year. So if you guys are looking for some sets before they disappear, Come in and check out this last four-foot section. That's where we're putting everything here this time. Bricks and Liam, you're asking about trade night. Trade night is next Sunday, not this Sunday. It is the third Sunday. This is only going to be the second Sunday. Yes. All right, next up here for our second half, we have from Marvel Spider-Man, the Molten Man. Uh, oh, I'm on the wrong thing. No, wait. What the heck? Molten Man battle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was looking at the, the bottom here because I'm so used to these being longer. Uh, and I was like, oh, wait. <laughs> yep. All right. So we have the multi man battle here. Complete almost a couple pieces. This is one piece off his back. Yeah, it's not too bad. A couple pieces off the feet. Nothing too crazy. Complete figures, all the web. And tonight you can go home with a set for $20. It's a cool, it's a cool build. And we got Marion Bal Valencia uh, claiming lot number 18 as well. Well, all right. Welcome She's to you. Two for two. Two for two. Yep, her and Keanu are the only ones uh, clean so far tonight. All right. All right, we're going to move on to lot number 19 while he's doing that. We've got another set from our uh, expert creator modular line here. Tonight we've got our pet shop set. Um, this one comes with four mini figures and a couple of animals as well because, of course, it's a pet shop. Um, there are other animals inside as well. Um, this one has been completely rebuilt and is 100% complete. Um, except for this is the torso, right? Her torso. Her torso is the only thing that is not correct. It's very close, but it is not 100% uh, correct. So we'll call it 99.9% .9 complete. Um, you can pick this one up here tonight with the instructions for $180. And this one is a separ separatable one as well. So this actually comes apart. Ooh, look at that. Two be one becomes two. What? <laughs> no way. So you can, of course, break the set up and then put them throughout your city. If, of course, you're doing the modular line of stuff. Lot number 20 over here is something that we got uh, very, very recently, and it's kind of a rare set. And you it's the won't first really... time this set has been in, too. Yeah, you won't really find this one in too many places. Um, this one is actually an education set, um, and normally we've seen this go from as, anywhere around like $60 all the way up to like, what was it, $140, $150? I saw it for higher. Um, it's, a, it's a pretty expensive set, but of course, it is what it is. Um, so we just wanted to make sure that you guys got a pretty good deal on it. This is our door and window kit uh, that came out. There's 278 pieces in here. That is all roof pieces. You can see all the red roofing pieces here, um, as well as a ton of doors, windows, and that's right, folks, shutters. So your these window frames come with the little clips on the sides to clip on your shutters. So you can have both indoor and outdoor windows, shutters, um, which is amazing. Um, and a great education set to learn how to build uh, and construct your roofing. You can see all the elements that are here as well. So, of course, like I said, you have your, your, you have your frames and your shutters, your shutter holders, and, of course, all your rooftop here. So, awesome, awesome set. Still new in box, and tonight you can get it only for $60. Okay. Lots of doors and windows in there. <laughs> all right, next up here. Lot... Yeah, right? <laughs> Line number 21 from Speed Champions. This here is the McLaren Sienna. This here is complete with the extra set of rims, and I mean, check out this vehicle. This, this is one of my favorite cars. It's definitely one of the best. Speed I collect all the Speed Champions. This is one of my favorite ones. Um, because I really love the fact that uh, when you take this apart, um, these stickers here are actually on an inverted um, windscreen. 
So there's one upside down and one on top as well, yep. which is really, really kind of cool. And and somewhat unique to this. There's one other card that kind of does that, but this one definitely did it a lot better. Um, so you can get the McLaren Sunday here tonight. It's for the cheapest amount you'll ever get a McLaren for only $12. And it comes complete with the wind total. Ed figure with the extra set of rims. Yes. Do, 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 do. All right, next up here, lot number 22. This is one we've had in the store before. It is a creator three-in-one, and this is the modular poolside holiday. Set. Yes. Um, so you got a grill on top, a little table tennis, a skateboard, a pool, and then inside you got this little like gaming hangout, which is pretty cool. And then these come off. They're they're only on by a couple like studs. Yep. So you could swap them if you want. Swap them, rearrange or, them. Yep. Um, it was a really nice, simple three in one that Lego did. And the other two builds aren't bad either. Yeah. So a cute little set here. And of course, it comes with two mini figs with their ping pong paddles and everything else, the table tennis paddles, uh, for only $20. Yep. Only $20. All right, moving back to architecture, we have lot number 23 over here. We've got the Paris set. That's yep. right, folks. Um, they, Lego actually just celebrated a huge um, day of play and everything else in Paris not too long ago. And, of course, they do have the new Eiffel Tower that's coming out that's uh, five feet tall, roughly. Um, but if you don't want the five-foot one, you can get the 10-inch one over here. Um, and the Paris Skyline set it includes box and instructions. Uh, and, of course, you've got the Louvre. You've got the Eiffel Tower here. I do not know what that one is. And, of course, the Arc de Triumph. Yeah, this there. is the first time we've had this set in, too. A lot of yep. people were asking about it, and we finally got this in. I did have Singapore here, um, but that sold earlier. Yeah, Singapore sold really quick. Yeah, that one's a beautiful set. It, it is. It's such a good job on it. Yep. So the architecture line here tonight, of course, uh, the Paris set can be yours for only $30, including box and instructions. And lot number 24, Dave, why don't we talk about this? We have an original... Blue, uh, was it Taraka Kaba? Taraka Kaba. Yeah. Set here, it's a little rock'em sock'em robot here. Um, it Crazy is tea. missing a few parts and its counterparts. Uh, we've got Tiana Vasquez claiming lot number 23, Paris. Oh no! Yes, God. Oh, <laughs> stop, <no>. stop. <laughs> yeah, so tonight you can get this set here. It is missing its counterpart, but I mean, just this one alone goes for 25 bucks. Yes, the U set, if it is complete, because there was a second part of this, I think it was, was it black? No, it was or like dark gray or something like that. Oh, it's that's like right, it was the, the turquoise teal. color. Yeah. Um, goes for $90 as a set. Yeah, we had it here complete one time and certified. Yeah, uh, but it's a really cool little little easy set. It's a very early bionicle set. They had like three different iterations of these um, and different lines. Yeah, and you're supposed to hit the other one on the mouse here, right, and then to the mask off. will pop off. Yep. Cool. So uh, the blue Tarakawa can be yours for only $25. Um, holy smokes. Okay. Um, sure. All right. <laughs> we can try this. Uh, we have a multiple claim. Um, I don't think so. Uh, okay. And she put the name in there too. Awesome. All right. So we've got a claim for lot number two. Chris, if you could double check that lot number two for 25, that is correct. Okay. So lot number two. Uh, lot number 20 for $60. You said this right. 20 is actually on this side. Hold on a sec. 20. Okay, yep, the, uh, the door window kit, awesome. You're not going to go wrong with that one. And 22, which is the modular poolside house. Okay, awesome. Sweet, all right. So Brittany Alton is going to go ahead and take all of those home. Lots 2, 20, and 22. Congratulations. Holy smokes. I've never had a multi-claim before. That's kind of cool. All right, <laughs> well, here we go. Line number 25 from the Lego Mario line. We have the... Uh... Lakitu, how do you say that? Lakitu. Lakitu, Lakitu. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you want to put like an abbreviation on it or something. This is his Sky World here. We haven't shown this set off before. It's a nope. really cool one. So you can put two different characters on it. And what happens is it shifts this gear at the bottom. So you can do it fast enough. He's supposed to just Fall pop off. off. Yep. And then his disc here. There's also like the bullet. And this little like squishy urchin thing. I can't remember. It was the name for him. He's a spike ball. But yeah. 
The only, I know this character because it's on, you know, like Mario Kart and stuff like that. But as for the others, I'm like, <laughs> eh, I don't really know. And then this here can give you 30, 30 seconds, seconds yep, instead of 15 from the originals yeah. ones. Uh, but this is, this is one of the new lines that came out this year, of course, with uh, the new Luigi starter pack. So you put Mario on one side, Luigi on the other side. However, there's also the new Princess Peach, Princess Peach. starter pack, which we also have here. Dun, 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 dun. So you can use Princess Peach as well. So a lot of cool things going on with this set. Yep, yep. All right, next up here. This one has not been in before. This is a complete set. I think it does have an extra sticker sheet right there. Yep. Funny enough, I turned on the right page. <laughs> This is our Technic dirt bike. Um, it's also like a two-in-one, so you can do like a low rider here. Mm -hmm. It's pretty nice. And look at this. Spring, there it goes. you can see it move with the chain and everything. Full rotation. Well, kickstand. You can just fold up right here. Yeah, and of course it's got the side two-cylinder engine with the the movable piston heads as well. Yeah, and it's got like the little brakes here, a little gas can or knob for gas the filler. Yep, yeah. gas fill. Um, and of course, a little uh, sport exhaust on the back. Yeah. Um, so yeah, those are those are supposed to be movable. Yeah, we could adjust the fairings on it as well. It's pretty nice. Um, so this dirt bike comes complete with box and instructions for only twenty five dollars. Just like Fortnite. Yeah, right. <laughs> dirt bikes are reentered into Fortnite. You are correct. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna get to this one. This one we have never had on the stream before. It is one of the top rare Star Wars figures. Never had it before. Never had it before. Never had it in the stream. Never had it in the store. We've had parts, which is why it's here tonight, because we finally fixed it, even though it's been sitting for months. Chris? Yep. Yep. I'm looking at you. Because <laughs> um, you put it in the drawer and told me not to touch it. <laughs> when I fixed it in 30 seconds with your dad. Facts. Moving on. <laughs> here we go. This is the poly bag uh, opened. Shadow Arf Trooper from Lego Star Wars. This figure is worth over 200 and tonight you can get it for 175 It is complete. It's in great shape. And again, this is the first time we've had it here in the store and on the street. Yes, and this is, of course, from the Shadow Arf Trooper poly bag. I'm going to hold it up. Yes, it's an awesome, awesome figure. It is a one of a kind. For 175. Yes, it is an amazing, amazing figure. It probably will not last till Christmas because somebody will pick it up if they do not pick it up tonight. However, this is the only time we will ever have this on sale. After this, nope. it's, it's just gonna keep going up. Be on sale after that. <laughs> yes, awesome figure. We will never have one. We've never had one before, and it's it's just a great piece to have. So, all right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Before we get to our mystery boxes, we have three bigger mystery boxes for sale. Tonight you can get one of each for forty dollars. Yes, yeah, so you need to pick blue, yellow, or green. They're all forty dollars a piece. Normally they're forty-five, fifty dollars, brand new. Mm -hmm. um, these are obviously just have the cardboard taken off of them. <laughs> and apparently you get a free Batman sticker in the yellow one. Um, but we have these for $40 a piece. Uh, of course, these are the same style and same vendor as our uh, mystery boxes here. Of course, these are just much, much, much bigger. Um, and of course, we do still have a couple of our smaller 2 by 2s up on the wall. So uh, if you guys are looking for some storage boxes, of course, as Dave takes this off. Dave, can you take the lid off again? I'll hold this side. It does have quite a bit of storage. I will, however, say um, I do not know why they do this with all of theirs or the majority of theirs. I would t definitely take some clear silicone or whatever and fill these in. No, you could just put like a, sh a little paper. Ah, I would something. just fill it in. Like... But uh, all the little one by ones and stuff and little tiles and everything will get stuck sometimes in there, and you will have to work to get them out with a screwdriver. Plate of yellow on the bottom, and then you put a yeah, yellow I mean, plate. Put a yellow plate on the bottom. A couple base plates in there to make it work. You're tall. Yeah, uh, but yes, we have all three of these available. If you guys want, just let us know. Claim lot number twenty-eight for forty bucks, and then let us know what color or how many you want, and we'll get them 
I'll set it for you. All right, folks, that means it's time for Mystery Boxes. Yep, so we have three of them here tonight to go with the themes we always have, typically. And tonight, as normal, in order for you to see what is inside, you have to claim it first. So you can do lot number 29, the green box here, I believe you had for $6. $6. The yellow box here for $7, or the red box here for 5 these boxes themselves are not for sale, but we do have the bigger ones. Yes. And some other smaller ones. You get what's inside the box, not the box. Yes. So let's just uh, recap here. You get lot number 29 or the green six. box for $6. <laughs> and there goes the fire alarm. Sorry, guys. Oh, shoot. I can't get out this way. I got no keys. Sorry, guys. Hold on. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and close that door. Um, if you can't can't tell, this is a live show. Uh, our fire alarm is now going off. It's not us, I swear. It's not us. Um, can I get a coat though? Can can somebody grab my coat so I'm not freezing out here? Um, so I'm gonna change the camera here. Hold on a second. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Settings camera. Yay, a video outside. Hi, guys. Oh, I got it backwards. It? I got it backwards. All right, there we go. Woohoo. We're back. So, Hello. <laughs> so now we are outside because the fire alarm is going off. I'm sure, be, I'm sure you lot. saw me and the camera jump. Because <laughs> well, we were not expecting that. Well, not only that, thank you, Sarah, for giving my coat because it's raining and wet outside. Um, <laughs> They're all too scared to come out. That's a good question. Um, more than likely, which happens to be the case, uh, Crusade Burger, which is on the other end, all the way down there, which of course is why all of our parking lot is pretty full, um, likely set it off because of their grill or something else, because every time the fire alarm goes off the past <laughs> year, it's always been that unit down there. Um, no offense to Crusade Burger, but uh, it kind of happens there. Hi, Sarah. Hey. Um, it, is, it is very unfortunate, yes. Um, <laughs> we will try to resume. We will resume the show. We're not even going to turn this off. So if you guys are welcome to do whatever. No, you can hang with us outside. We're going to hang we're out here outside. Here outside. Yeah. You can actually, if I, if I'm going to walk across the street here, you guys can see how beautiful um, our store looks. I'm going to clean this camera off because this is a little messed up. I'm going to go ahead and bring this out here. You guys can see how beautiful our store looks when it's dark outside. If you guys haven't uh, ever been outside before, and of course. Uh, you got our restaurant little plaza down the way here as well. You know, this camera is so messed up. Hold on a second. All right. Hopefully that's better. I had a little smudge still on the camera. Um, yeah, so we're out here um, hanging out. And actually, I'm going to turn this banner off. It's <laughs> Christopher left it on. Uh, we're going to take that off. And we're going to take off this other one here. And then we'll get to you guys' comments. So how, how are you guys doing all today? We're going to turn that off. <laughs> there we go. Greetings from the Bricks and Minifix parking lot. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty uh, soon you get to meet the entire fire department of, or not the entire fire department, but the probably, entire probably fire. like you know, engine number, Do you see some no, engine five, I think, fire? coming down over here. So. Um, for those of you guys who don't know, we actually have the fire department, like the main fire department right down the block here. Um, but it still takes them like 10 minutes to get here because, of course, the firemen have to get all suited up and everything every time the fire alarm goes off. Um, so the entire plaza here will shortly be emptying, if not emptying already somewhere, even though a lot of the people eating are probably just dealing with it. Um, but the fire alarm is very, very loud. Like earmuffs. <laughs> Done. Yeah. Um, so well, we are, when we get inside, we, I, it should only take a few minutes, hopefully, as long as there's not a real fire. Um, oh, but there's what's that? Says there's on their end. What do you mean well, nothing on their end? somebody bricked up. What do you mean? They said they're not, they don't have any Oh, well, it's probably their, their unit still, anyway. Well, why isn't anyone here yet? It takes them like 10 minutes, I told you. <laughs> oh, we know. So, uh, the, we're, you, Dave and I are used to this, of course, because uh, this happens to us about every two, three months, give or take, um, regardless of what's going on outside. We were due for it. Um, yeah, we haven't had well, one in now, a while. Now, as you can see, we have people running to their cars. Yeah, people are going to the cars now because they're tired of waiting outside. Um, so we are just kind of hanging out here. We will continue the show as soon as we get the fire department to clean, clear out the fire alarm. 
Um, I do apologize for anybody who might have gone slightly deaf um, listening to the fire alarm going off inside because it is a very, very loud fire alarm. Um, and uh, yeah, as you guys can see, you know, you can see it off the reflection. All the lights are going off here. You can see the light right there going off. It's a little less bright there than here. Um, I'm going to go telescopic here. Hold on a second. Maybe you guys can see the... No, nope, maybe not. Is there, is it over there? Yeah, they're coming. Get up. Get back. So fire alarm, fire, fire department's coming here. Uh, we actually have our our gimbal now on full extension, so we can we can see everything else. How are you doing, Dave? I'm cold. <laughs> this is I how think, I'm doing. I think Dave's cold. It's cold. But now they're here. Yep, they're they're finally they're blowing up right now. You can see, you guys, the uh, yeah, fire response. Yeah, I can't go back in for my coat. So, fire response is here already. So I told you guys it only takes a couple minutes. My car that's gonna warm up um, in like two seconds. They're gonna they're gonna come in. They're gonna tell if anything's wrong or not. Turn it off. Let everybody back in. Hopefully, we should be good. I mean, we're the only ones outside. And then, but we, did, did, while we're out here, did anybody claim the mystery boxes? I have no idea. Not yet. <laughs> oh yeah, actually, uh, Miriam claimed a uh, green box. Oh, right terrific. there, he's got the green box. Well, really as good. soon as we get inside, we'll show you what's You in got there. the green box. Yeah, we'll get to Hey, shut up. <laughs> While nice. we're on stream. Awesome. Nice. All right. Fine. Okay. Over. okay. <laughs> so this is always a fun part here, guys. <laughs> as you can see, the, uh, the uh, always fire marshal. Always something here. Cool. Always the something. Yeah. There comes the uh, the big unit fire truck. Dave, did you leave the door unlocked? Yes, okay. I, the door I was like, unfortunately, we also have an enunciator panel in our store, so whenever there's a fire here, they either go down to the restaurant, <laughs> which is likely where it's from, or they come to ours to figure out where the the problem is. Um, Garrett is Garrett is posting. Uh, who's excited about Avatar two? I'm Yay. excited about Avatar two. Chris is excited about Avatar two. Um, we actually just rewatched uh, the original Avatar. I think like two weeks ago. I think. Um, so the boys can check it out and everything else, but I think uh, I think the uh, Avatar Two is going to be awesome. Um, so we'll see what's what's going on with that. And here comes the the big unit here. You guys can see right there rolling in to help out. See what's going on. This is a pretty good light out here. I'm surprised. Right? <laughs> well, the uh, iPhone 12 Pro Max can uh, no, can do a lot of things. <laughs> oh well, congrats to you. <laughs> <laughs> well, <his> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> you just say he got a free you meal. Got a free meal because they told him to leave. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it didn't say leave and come back. So um, I have so, to rewatch yeah. the first one again. Yes. Uh, wait, what happened? The fire alarm is going off. Yep. See, you see the lights in the truck right there. Apparently, right they there. were uh, talking. Uh, uh, Chris Sandberger was talking to the, the actual fire department about five fifteen tonight, and said everything was good. So now we don't five know. Five fifteen. Five fifteen. They had contacted them and said, "Yes, everything looks good. We're good to go," or whatever. He just walked down here earlier. But for what though? I'm so confused. Make sure that their system was good and everything. Oh, there's another fire truck. Well, clearly not, because now we got fire trucks and pot fire trucks loading in here. So there's one more trying to pull. We'll over see what there happens. <laughs> so I do appreciate you guys hanging out with us during our fire evacuation here. Um, Oh, I think we're going to give it a second. Hey, there we go. Hopefully everybody's back. We are inside again. <laughs> Sorry for that. Uh, somehow there was some delay um, with feed. Is everybody here? Can you guys see us? 
please let us know to make sure that everything's still working okay. Uh, we do have 28 people here still, which thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. It's the first time we've ever had to evacuate for a fire alarm midstream here. Midstream? Um, <laughs> don't, don't touch the streams. <laughs> uh, don't cross the streams here. Yep, that's right. Okay, we are working. Okay, cool. All right. I'm going to go ahead and take my coat off. I'm going to leave it nearby just in case because I don't trust them at all. Thank you, Sarah, for taking that. I'm going to go ahead and switch wrong button here i am working on my phone switch the cameras back to dave over here back camera bam there we go all right we are back guys sorry about that long wait um thank you guys so much for staying with us we're a little we're a little chilly now and a little little wet all right so who claimed the green box? Uh, give me one second here hold on a second all right if i go back i go back oh, wait we have Marion valencia thank you so much for watching we claimed lot number 29 the green box for six dollars you get an awesome Recycling truck. Did it, did it, did it, did it, did it, did it. Awesome. Congratulations, Miriam. Um, next up, we have, let's see here, Lisa Sturgeon claiming lot number 30, the yellow box, for $7. You get this awesome Avenger cycle with Captain. New America. inbox Avenger cycle. Woohoo. Right. Awesome. And then we have Gavin Wanick. Claiming lot number 31, the red box. For five dollars. You get this awesome puppy to take home. Yes, the little pug dog peeing out of fire hydrant. How convenient. <laughs> Considering we, we just had our fire alarm. It was kind of funny. <laughs> All right, guys. We're gonna go ahead and do one final recap of everything in the store as Dave's already after that Dave's like, I'm checking out, I'm ready to go home. Let's, let's just get out of here. Um, we're gonna go ahead and do one final recap. Uh, in the meantime, if you guys have any questions about any of our product, let us know. I do also want to show off the fact that we are actually still taking toys, um, un 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 or unwrapped new toys for Toys for Tots. We are a collection point for them. Um, until, like, I think we've got, like, a couple more days, they're going to go pick that up. So stop by this weekend if you can, if you have anything to donate. Um, I also want to show off the fact that we are carrying Brick Forge again as well. It's been, like, three years um, since they've been in here. We have knights. There's uh, military guys, police officers, all sorts of things. we got... Um, what do they call them? Uh, powered assault kits, which are basically like Halo kits, um, dwarf kits, all sorts of things in here. And of course, to go along with our brick arms and other um, newer poly bags as well behind the counter. So lots of other stuff coming in. And of course, as a reminder, we have our uh, holiday Droidica build coming up that we're going to be announcing here um, shortly. Well, not announcing, but setting up and registering for. Um, we have about 30 of those kits available you, for you guys. Did you create instructions for it? I do have instructions for it. Really? Yep. It's really simple build. And I'm hopefully gonna get it all done on one like a one page instruction manual. So one it should be a pretty page. pretty quick thing. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and start this off all the way at the beginning here. We're gonna go through this and then we're gonna call it a night because we are now cold and wet. Uh, but if you guys have any questions in between, let us know. Um, starting with lot number one, we've got our beach house. This is an expert creator. Our creator set comes is a three in one, comes with no minifigures, but extra parts in all three instruction manuals for $45. Lot number three is our Lego lunch boxes. We have an orange and yellow lunch box, of course, here with a front pouch, interior pouch, and lined interior, fully lined, um, insulated interiors. Um, these are $20 a piece. You can let us know if you want orange or yellow uh, for $20 a piece. Or both. Or both. Uh, lot number four is our treehouse set over here. We do have it on sale tonight only, which is going to be for the next, like, five minutes. Uh, for $200. It's only at least $250 currently. This is a sealed certified set, 200 bucks. Could be yours going home. Lot number five is our Technic Land Stalker, our Technic Land Rover Defender. I almost called it a Land Stalker. Uh, <laughs> with bonus light kit um, that you will have to install yourself. It does have instructions and stuff on the inside as well. Um, you can get both of this with box and instructions for $140. Um, in the bags, in the bag set, is there a Christmas tree by chance? Uh, what bag set are you talking about? What, which bag set is she asking about? I'm confused. Poly bags. Oh, the poly bags? There's no Christmas trees. No. Christmas tree. There's a Christmas train, but not a Christmas tree. Um, all right, moving on to lot number six over here. We've got Elsa's um, Magical Ice Palace. Uh, this one is $45. Comes with Elsa, Olaf, and the Snogies, um, as well as some extra accessories and builds for $45. Bucks. Lot number eight is our Heavy Duty Tow Truck, 2,000 piece set. Uh, for $100, has lots of play functions as well. Really cool set. It's about 22, 24 inches long. 
Um, holds a lot of weight. It's a really, really cool set for $100. All right, moving on to lot number nine. We've got our UCS Tumblr set over here with, of course, our Heath Ledger Joker and Batman uh, with all five instruction books and the complete Tumblr itself, uh, all for $160. Uh, lot number three. She would like the yellow. Awesome. Okay, that's going to be the yellow lunchbox. She's gone. For $20. Dave, do you mind zipping that up? Thank you, sir. You want me to do it on So we have... I don't care. So we do still have the orange one left, if anybody is interested in the orange one for $20 in lot number three. All right, where did we left off? Lot number nine, okay, we're gonna go to lot number 10. Is there Expert Creator Assembly Square Modular? This one comes with 11 minifigures, including the little baby in the carriage, um, as well as the three building modular set with box and instructions. You get all 4,000 pieces here for $250. Lot number 11 is our the new White House set. This one comes with box and instructions as well for $55. Lot number 12 from Lego Marvel is our Hulk's Helicarrier Breakout set with Hawkeye, Loki, Thor, and Hulk for $40, including instructions. Lot number 13 is the Ninjago City Garden set. This one is a uh, 5,685-piece set. Bam, right there. Um, with a ton of minifigures. I think it's like 19 or 20 or something like that. You get a lot of minifigures um, in this set. I do not have a total count off the top of my head. Uh, but you do get this awesome four-and-a-half, five-story building. Um, to go on to your Ninjago City um, docks and your Ninjago City sets as well. Um, they all go together, and tonight you can get this one on sale again, $300. Lot number 14 is our buildable General Grievous uh, here tonight, $70, uh, for $70, it's $10 off on sale tonight. Uh, this one is new in box sealed. Lot 15 is our Spyclops infiltration set here for $10, bucks. includes both minifigures and this cute little set. Lot number 17 is uh, from the Batman movie, the new Batman movie. Uh, has the Batman and Selena Kyle motorcycle pursuit and the Penguin chase. Of course, it's, uh, Selena Kyle is Catwoman or becomes Catwoman later. Um, and you get both of these sets here with the instructions for the bike chase uh, for $35. Moving on to the second half of the show. We have lot number 19, which is the Expert Creator Pet Shop. Uh, soon to be called the Icons Pet Shop. Um, with all the figures and everything else here, it's 99% complete except for the girl's torso. It is incorrect. Um, you just have to order the correct one later. Uh, but it does come with both of the instruction books on the cardboard backer uh, to prevent any kind of damage or anything else to the instructions. And you can pick up this lot here tonight for $180. Lot number 20 is from one of my favorite uh, lines here. It's the Speed Champions McLaren Senna. Includes the McLaren, the uh, driver, extra uh, hubcaps or wheels, wheel wells, um, and the wind tire around here for only $12. Originally, this was a $22 set. You can get it for half off at $12. That's pretty solid. Um, Paris was claimed. Lot number 24 is from Lego Bionicle. You have the blue Tarakaba. Um, it is one half of a set, but it's one half of a $90 set. And you can get this one here tonight for only $25. It is fully functioning with the Bionicle mask included. And you get it, again, for $25. Bucks. Lot number 25 from LEGO Super Mario. We've got the Lakitu Sky World set. Of course, it's a two-person set. So you do want to be playing with a friend or a sibling. Um, I didn't have two, either two Marios, Mario, Luigi, Luigi, and Prince Peach, whatever you want. Um, but it does require too many things to, to do this one um, for, and you get this for only $16. It's, like, it's actually a really cute and colorful set. I'm not going to lie. Lot number 26 is the Technic Dirt Bike set we have here complete uh, with both instructions, the uh, box and set here tonight with extra new stickers uh, for only 25 bucks. And then lot number 27, of course, is the biggest surprise of the night. Is our super rare Shadow Arf Trooper. Um, this came out of the Shadow Arf Poly Bag. And tonight you can get it on sale. The only time it'll be on sale for $175. And then next up and finally, we have our lot number 28. Our 2x4 storage box with three of these available in blue, green, and yellow for $4 a piece. All you have to do is, just like the other set, is let us know that you're claiming Lot 28 and which color or colors you want. Back to you, Dave. Back to me? Why? No, no, no. We're done. <laughs> Wait, what's behind you? What? what? Where's your back? Lego. <laughs> Lego, Lego, Lego. We got Lego everywhere. That's what I'm we buying. What, Chris? No, that's not for sale. That's it. Okay. This kid over Your here. Your voice isn't staying over there. <laughs> I hear it over here. It's lingering. 
<laughs> you guys are killing me. All right, All right guys. So make sure you guys tune in hopefully next week for our final Cyber Fun Day of the Year for 2022. Fingers and toes um, crossed. Thank you guys for watching. I apologize again for the crazy loud blaring fire alarm earlier. We have no choice over that. You know, we don't control those fire alarms. Uh, Sarah's shaking her head. Um, but join us for that. And of course, we will. Uh, we have a ton of stuff here. If you guys are looking for Christmas presents or holiday gifts, please come see us sooner than later if so we, we can get it in time. we don't do a live stream for Cyber Fun Day, maybe you guys can do something else. We'll do something. Do something. Um, and then, of course, come January, we have, of course, New Year's, followed by our five-year story anniversary. So we're going to be having a bunch of stuff here. Stay tuned next week. because And hopefully a secret special guest performer for our five years. Lots of new so, releases, yes. And yes, a ton of new releases. We actually just ordered, got to order more today. So we're hoping those get here in time. Um, we've got a ton of new stuff. Of course, January 1st has like 130 sets coming out. Um, unfortunately, not a lot of Star Wars. I think it's only like two Star Wars sets that are coming out. It's very, very little. Is it three? It's very, very little. Uh, so hopefully like March, They're April will bad. be a lot. Uh, but we will see you guys then. Uh, thank you, Dave, for uh, your last time hosting of 2022. Oh, yeah. Uh, of course, and then yeah, I'll give him a pause. Yay! Bye, 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 bye. So, everybody say, uh, you know, give Dave uh, a good bye, bye, wishing. Bye. Of course, he's also we moving into it. a new apartment. I'll see you guys soon. I'm gonna still be here. I'm not going anywhere. He's I'm still here. here. Um, I have to be here. so we will definitely catch you guys soon. Thank Lego's you guys so much for watching. Apartment. What Lego's paying for my apartment. <laughs> and uh, mini fig swap night, mini fig trade night is next, next Sunday, Sunday. From three to five. So, the more built figures you have, the more complete they are and the more yes. they're going to be worth first hour to trade with other people and full details are on our website as well break so many things.com slash crest hill illinois it's all on there uh it's just a repetitive date so it's always on there you always know what it is we had a lot of people. yeah i wasn't here but dave and david owen were here and they said they had a ton so of people many, here so it was so really good so many figures I, I probably put away like 100 or so figures yeah. in the case yeah Let's. So thank you guys so much for watching. We will catch you guys next week. Bye, Hopefully, guys. if not, we will see Happy you in 2023. Happy Hanukkah. I know. Bye. <laughs> All right. We'll see you guys later. We're out of here. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.